KSI after his last fight called out Andrew Tate and backtracked and said he was way too heavy for him and way too big, but Andrew Tate had to say this. Uh, so yeah, so KSI, KSI did an interview where he said he knew I'd smoke him before his fight. Then he beat up two nobodies and now he thinks he can fight. And then he said he, <laughs> then he said my name after the fights along with his True Jordy was there, who's a, a cock who begs for dildos up his ass, by the way. Facts. <laughs> in case you didn't know. Exposed. Stupid. Yeah, but um, KSI said my name, and then I started getting in conversations about fighting him, and then he came out and said, now I'm too heavy, now I'm too big. He doesn't want to fight me. Look, KSI doesn't want a real fight. And and to be honest with you, I'll be completely fair, because I'm a professional. I don't get emotional about these things. If you can fill an arena beating up idiots, why fight someone for real? Why? Like, I mean, he can fill. Yeah. He can fill, make the money too. He can make. He can make a bunch of money and fight nobodies with zero risk. So why take the risk of getting your face smashed up badly and having all of it ended? Right. So True. that's what he's doing. Right. Logan's an agent of the Matrix. Logan sold his soul <laughs> completely and utterly. He's uh, in dis yeah, he's a disingenuous individual. On Twitter, KSI's manager Mams has early not tried to put the fight together for KSI, and instead of trying to put Logan Paul to fight Andrew Tate as they're a similar size. But let me know down in the comments if you want to see KSI fight Andrew Tate. Also, leave a like and subscribe with notifications on.